All right, well, it's been a long time since we posted a video. I think this is like the second or third video of this year. Large reason pack prices are higher than single card sales and a large portion of how I funded these videos was selling the cards after I opened the packs. Because of just like stock market, crypto going down in 2022, card sales largely went down too. But, oh, and uh, the dealer that I used to buy from stopped selling cards. And that's how I got all my good deals for the old packs. However, today I got a text message that he had cards again. So I bought some stuff and in there was second year Kobe. So this is a 97 tops not tops chrome but it has the possibility of having refractors in it five cards a pack so we're gonna open 15 cards it's gonna be a quick video but at least a video in 2022 will be posted again on tipsy breaks i uh, still post a lot on my instagram so follow instagram sometimes i post on tiktok under the same name instagram is where you'll see more stuff than YouTube at this point, but I will be doing a YouTube video of the Burbank card show at the end of the month, as well as maybe a couple more pack videos like this one. Let's get to it. All right, let's get going. I'm gonna use scissors. I started opening this and it didn't work. Just like the old days when I used to open a ton of packs on this channel, they, they don't open as simple for me as they do for others. So we need scissors. All right, let's open these and hope that we have a refractor. All right, these are awesome cards. I, I like when Tops used to make basketball. Matt Maloney. Henry James. Anthony Peeler. AC Green, last card, gonna wanna be something special. John Stockton. John Stockton, Hall of Famer. Nice looking card, nicely centered. All right, next pack. Again, we're looking for, obviously second year Kobe, but um, Jordan, any refractor. I don't think Jordan has his upper deck license at this point. If you guys don't know, you can only get a, really a Jordan card with upper deck at this point. Oh, another AC green on the back. Oh, we just had this card, so let's show it again. Same card. Wesley Pearson. Scotty Pippen. This is during the Bulls run. This is a good card. Bimbo Coles. And a Gary Trent. All right. Last pack mojo. I picked these packs because they felt slightly thicker than the others. Thinking there was a refractor in one of these. Honestly, probably need a refractor to recoup the cost of these packs. They were $11 each, $11.99. But a Kobe would, would suffice to replace that. All right, Charles Barkley, another Hall of Famer. Nate McMillan. Doug Christie. Come on, three cards left, or two cards left after this Doug Christie. Oh, they, Andrew Lang and Steve Smith. All right, so let's look at the, what I think are the three best cards. We got this Charles Barkley. I mean, Topps just made such better products than, than really anything else for basketball. Look at that, it's just so clean. Slightly off center on the back, but you know, left to right, but just looks better than anything. Honestly, I think Upper Deck or Panini put out. Scotty Pippen, this one's just slightly off center again, but such a clean looking card. This is how basketball cards looked when I was a kid, and this is how I expect them to look. 
John Stockton. This one I think is like dead centered. Yeah, pretty good on the back too. Pretty, pretty late in all three of their careers. Great cards nonetheless. Thanks for joining. Thanks for joining. And like I said, you know, I'll keep trying to do more videos now that I can get some packs again and we'll hit something big. It's coming.